For years, the Archers has tackled the big storylines affecting farming, and now the focus is flooding. To make sure the soap is true to life, they've been speaking to people in Worcestershire affected by rising waters. There's still people who are caught up in the, the floods, you know, 12 months, 15 months on, who still aren't in their homes. So there's a long, long way to go with this storyline. And you get talking to people and you realise that actually the shock and the trauma of what has happened is just below the surface. It's still very, very raw. Well, it's been raining for days now in Ambridge, but how have they made it sound so realistic? It's time for me to meet the team behind the sound effects, and I need these. If we wanted an actor to sound like he was walking through water, he walked through water, so if you would like to try the bucket. Okay, let's see if I'm any good at sound effects. Yep, it sounds a lot like bad. It, yeah. good, good bad. water. And that was when the flood was, was pretty well established, mm -hmm. but when it was just starting, or for areas that weren't particularly affected by the flood, we just had the squidgy mat. So if you'd like to try what the muddy mat sounds like. Oh, goodness me. Oh, yeah. Simple but effective. Well, that's a brief behind the scenes look. They're not giving anything else away about the plot, but with floodwaters still rising, it'll be some time before things return to normal in Ambridge.